Hello everyone. In this episode, I want to show you a little trick that I've learned this week about how to flip normal maps inside of Substance Painter. So the thing is, I've made a dress in Marvelous Designer and it has nice normals to just show the the sewing lines here. And it's less about the, the normals that you might just about pick up here. It's more about these ones here that are kind of indicating the sewing lines and they quite clearly go in. That's what they're supposed to, yeah, that's what it's supposed to look like. But if I go and export the normal maps out and bring them into Substance Painter, um, watch what happens here. So currently I only have a flat material on there, just took the roughness out. And on my assets library here, if I switch to the project, then I've got these two normal maps here. And if I go and left click and drag those onto the normal channel, then I see this. And while they're indeed there, I think they're the wrong way around. And that's really not what we want to do. So I've looked literally everywhere in Substance Paint and I just couldn't find it. And thank you so much to Fugazi who brought me on the right track there. It has to do, of course, with the DirectX versus OpenGL interpretation of the normal maps, which means that the green channel points the other way around in either of these formats so there has to be an option to flip it but the way to find it was really difficult turns out it's actually here in this menu here so on the properties tab of your material here on the properties there is this unsuspecting menu up here and it's just not something you'd ever click but if you do it there's one option that's an additional option that you can enable which is called color spaces once again hasn't got anything to do with with normals but if you enable that then below your normal map there's another thing that comes up and if you open that up then you can go and switch this from auto which is direct 3d or direct x i guess to the other thing which is in this case um opengl so this is where you switch that and it's just it's just extremely extremely well hidden. So I don't know why they made that hidden, but this is where that is. And if I go and switch this from auto, which I don't really know what it infers it from, if you go and switch this to OpenGL, then boom, my normals point the correct way. Yeah, so that's where that is. It is not when you create a new project, you can say, is this supposed to happen in OpenGL or DirectX? And that's really only how Substance Painter interprets this particular project, but it has nothing to do with the maps that you import. Likewise, when you export your maps out later on, then you can also set which format would you like to export them out. And that, again, that's a different setting. This here, like the third one, that is in fact how the normal maps that you import into the app that you might want to add to an object that you're texturing, how they interpret it. So yes, very interesting. So on your properties tab here, on the normal channel, enable, click on this thing here so that color spaces is showing. If that's not enabled, then there's nothing that can flip the normal maps. Make that show and then pick the color space, I suppose, from this drop-down menu. That is all I have. I hope this was helpful and I hope I'll see you in the next video. Take care.